Hey gents, today we're talking about the new Samsung Air Dresser, a very cool appliance I've been using the past couple of months and I'm very impressed with it. If you're looking to simplify extending their life, your clothes and reducing your dry cleaning bill, this could be very interesting for you. Now this video is not sponsored, they did send one so that I could try it out, but opinions are all my own. The best way to summarize the air dresser is the way that my children describe it, which is the super cleaner. The primary use for the air dresser is to steam, refresh, and sanitize your clothing. And now I basically put my entire wardrobe through this thing in the past couple of months. So I've been able to test out the different cycles on polo shirts, suits, bathrobes, pillows, towels, and even face masks. And one of the things that's surprisingly helpful for is like when you get new clothes out of the box and it's folded and everything, the, the creases you get on there, is you steam it in there, instantly gone. They look great out of the box. Setup for the air dresser is very easy. It's about as tall as a refrigerator, but it has a very slim profile. It's made to fit into like a big walk-in closet and you don't need any water line for it. So all you need to do is get power to it. And then the small water tank will last between three to six cycles, depending on how long the cycle is. Like a sanitized cycle takes up way more water than just a quick steam does. And then there's a small drain tank, which you drain that that one takes almost like 10 to 12 cycles. So just like the little portable steamer I have here, it's just you fill up that small water reservoir and then it works for a while. There is a very handy quick reference guide and you can use the buttons on the front of the air dresser, but the primary way I've been using it is with the app. So there's recipes in the app to help you choose the best option. So not only can you start the cycles from the app, you get notifications of when it's done, but you can say whether it's baby clothes, denim, uh, or suiting, and then it'll recommend a cycle based on what and how you want it. The suit cleaning is very nice. So I've now cleaned pretty much all of my suits. I do them three at a time. I've done it on various cycles, and it's delicate on the fabrics while leaving them refreshed. I've also put in my duvet cover and my pillows on the sanitize function, and clean is unreal. Now the thing that this can't replace though is an actual dry cleaner but what it can do is extend the amount of time that you have to take clothes to there. So it can't replace like a true clean and wash. So at the end of a season, if you're gonna store your wool clothing, that's when you'd wanna take it to the dry cleaner. But in between dry cleaning cycles, the steam and the refresh cycles can help to extend the amount of time that you're going in there while still being delicate on the fabrics, unlike you know a dryer. There's special built-in hangers which help to get the steam you know, processed through the garments. And then there's an accessory rack on the door help with scarves and ties. And then there's a weight kit as well. You can use a weight kit to hang them in there and then you get that really nice, like clean steamed pressed look of the trousers. The real surprise for me is the sanitize cycle. There's a two hour, 15 minute cycle that uses super heat to really deep steam in garments and they recommend it for bedding. I use it on our duvet cover and on our pillow, but the real test was, you know how like every child has little stuffed animal they take with them everywhere all the time? We have both of those. And using the shelf accessory in the air dresser, I put all of the you know stuffed animals in there on that cycle. And when I took them out two hours and 15 minutes later, they legitimately felt so clean and smelled clean. That was the first time as I was using this, I was like, wow, this is a very powerful device. And I was very impressed with it from that point. The other thing you can do is add a dryer sheet to one of the compartments and that gives like a fresh finish to the drying. I haven't used that, we don't have dryer sheets in the house, but I have been using some of the dry cycles instead of doing like a no heat tumble in my dryer, which is what I do for a lot of my things. So it's like a really nice gentle drying for delicate garments. Now the build quality on the air dresser is top notch. It reminds me of other premium Samsung appliances like we have uh, the washer or the dryer at my house and you can tell that like there's a lot of attention to detail and the fit and finish just on the hinges the way that the door operates and the look of the unit itself is very sleek and very cool it just plugs into a standard power outlet you don't need the full-on 220 volt like dryer size plug and when i plugged it in i plugged it into a unit that measures kilowatt hours usage and i found it to be very efficient so my energy bill is not spiking or anything like that you know it's much lower than i have a space heater out in the studio that uses way more energy than this does and you can see in the cycle breakdown how much each of the cycles use so if you're very conscious of that then it's something you can take into consideration as well so the air dresser really simplifies your clothes at home whether you're steaming wrinkles and odors out of a suit sanitizing your throw pillows and bed sheets or giving your polo shirt collection a quick refresh as I did when they came out of storage for the summer. So it can reduce your dry cleaning bill, the time you spend ironing or steaming and extend the life of your clothes by treating them in a little bit more delicate manner than the traditional washer dryer. The full retail on this is $14.99 and I think you'll know if this is for you. So because it, it doesn't replace a washer and a dryer, it doesn't replace a dry cleaner, but it's in between. It reminds me a lot of when tablets were introduced and it's not gonna replace a computer, it's not gonna replace your smartphone, but 
there are things that you do on a tablet that are better than a computer and better than a smartphone. So it's for those in-between use cases. I'd much rather put my polos, my dress shirts, and, and especially suits into this versus a washer dryer because I know that I'm using less water and it's treating the items a little bit more delicately. Overall, the air dresser has made cleaning fun. Like I'm excited to put things in it and start the cycle and smell them when they come out. And so if you have the room or the space for a third device like this, I think it's worth looking into. You know, when I was thinking about living in New York and being in a small apartment and you don't have a, typically have a washer dryer unit, this would be a great option for that. And then you take some things to go get washed and, and cleaned every once in a while. So there is that kind of third use case scenario that you might look into. Very curious to hear your feedback and questions down in the comments. I'll do my best to answer those down below. You can also reach out at the underscore Cavalier on Twitter and Instagram. Until next time, gents, this is the Cavalier. Set up for the air.